Hey everyone, I'm Matt. Hi, I'm Desiree. And we're bringing you this week's Rising Tide West Coast Swing Guide. We are back to the Just Walk Series 2022 on the Rising Tide West Coast Swing Guide. We are here during the lazy, hazy, hot days of summer to chill out a little bit and show you walks that can be lazily but beautifully incorporated into your West Coast Swing patterns and your pattern craft. So, today we're going to talk about a walk that's really fun as a side-by-side -side that starts out with a shoulder height full entrance. So let's demo it and then let's break it down for our leaders and for our followers. One, two, three, and four, five, and six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four. Breaking this down for our leaders. I'm going to first talk about the getting into the walk, because in some way that part can actually be trickier than the walk itself. So I'm starting out with the shoulder height fold, picking up the other hand in the middle. So notice I'm like right in line with Desiree here, just like a normal shoulder height fold. This is count four. On five, I'm stepping out to the opposite side, turning on that foot for and, and then six, I'm landing and starting to get this arm ready to allow Desiree to go under. For these walks, you'll notice she's behind me at this point, so I'm going to extend and lift this arm, but I'm not really walking just yet because I want to let her catch up to me. Once she's caught up, then we can progress forward if we so choose. When I'm done, I can slide down this arm to finish out the pattern. For our followers, you want to be thinking about, of course, you're following, you're following, following along, all of a sudden, oh, you're in front of an audience or you're in front of like the chairs at your social dance, and it's a different moment. When this moment comes through, this is just a walk, walk, triple step, triple step. So just like your six count patterns, you be, can begin on your right foot as if you were dancing another pattern and think walk, walk, whatever you want to do here, right? The big thing here is hopefully the leader will have raised their arm up so that you know that there's a window to walk through. That should be a clear signal. The other thing that the leader will do effectively is they're not going to ask for compression. They're not going to ask for stretch. There's not a lot going on here. This is not our typical West Coast way connection moment. So you can be very light here. You're kind of on your own with the exception of finger touch here and here. From there, the styling is dictated really by the music. Now your leader might do something to indicate, okay, whether they're gonna groove or whether they're gonna shape or whether they're gonna march straight ahead, run straight ahead, and you could follow that lead. But in the absence of that kind of thing, if the leader is waiting on you, you could do something more choppy for a blues or something that's more fast paced, something more flowy for a lyrical, a contemporary piece, something slower. Up to you followers. Big thing is don't stress the connection. Wait for that window and then style your way through it. Show this whole thing one final time. One, two, three, and four, five, and six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. That was your guide. Thank you everyone for tuning in. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our YouTube channel, like our Facebook page, and check out our website at online store. Link in the description. Bye.